Hello guys, and this time with a BNB Flash Loan bot. After the Ethereum Flash Loan bot, people often ask me about the Binance Smart Chain version, and here you go. Then I start first with a disclaimer. You can still join my Discord channel, but the channel itself remains closed and only for bot user. The reason behind this is quite simple. This is only my hobby and I offer this for free and not with any attention to make profit. But people seem not to understand that and spamming me with text messages and start fudding when I cannot answer right away. And also people often join the channel and scam accusing because they saw a video on YouTube that flash loans or front run bots are scam. That's kind of funny. Anyways, feel free to message me if you have any kind of question regardless the bot, you can just message me private on Discord, it's no problem at all. So let's get things started. As always, you need to ensure to download MetaMask. you find this as always in the video description. Here you have, as always, also the supported browser, as always, as always. <laughs> you can just click here on install MetaMask for Chrome and make the procedure to create your wallet. When you finally create your wallet, just click here on MetaMask extension, go up here, add network. And then you have this site open. You go here, you have this also in the video description, and scroll down to until you find mainnet. So it's also this is the one you are probably looking for. Just copy and pass everything in here, and when you finish, just click on save. So uh, then the next step is we need to connect actually our MetaMask wallet to Remix. Now they changed something on Remix, we always need to make sure now that we clicked on Inject Web 3 and then we can actually connect it. I already did it. When you finally connect it, it should be appear in green. We can click on it. Here it's active. And then you can also see that your account, your wallet address is under account. And you have, in this case, 5.1 BNB. It says always on Ether, but it's in this case in BNB. All we need to do now is go to compiler and we need to choose 0 0.5.5 plus commit this one. And you can also make sure that, that you include 90 bytes. It's not really necessary, but yeah, it's better to have it marked in this case. And all we need to do now is we need to make a new file. We call it now TI BNB loan in this case. Then you have this blank sheet. We just pass copy our flash loan code in here. And when we did so, we go back to compiler and click on compile TI BNB loan. When you did everything correct, the green mark should appear. And this is really necessary to check because often people reached out to me in Discord and have a question like, huh, I don't know, nothing happened and stuff like that. Please double check if this is green. This is really important. So next step we need to do is we go over here to the token string. We name the token now TIBNB. Token symbol, we need just TBNB. And loan amount, often people ask me this in the Ethereum version as well. I keep my loan always to 1000, even if we use now in this case 5BNB because People often ask me, like, when I use 5 BNB, do I need to increase also the loan amount? No, I just keep it as always to 1000. All we need to do now is to click on transact in this case. Pay the fee. Just wait, the creation is pending. So we finally did that. And all we need to do now is to top up our flash loan with funds. We are sending, in this case, again, 5 BNB. We need now also again to wait until the transaction is finished. It could take a few seconds. Now the transaction is confirmed. All we need to do now is to click over here on action, pay again the fee. Transaction is again pending. And we're good to go. And I will see you guys now in an hour. I make now a small cut and show you the profits. So as you can see, we made roughly about 0.3 BNB during that time. I let the bot run for around an hour. 
and stopped it by clicking the action button again and received also my funds back. This can actually take up to an hour, so it is not instant, so just take your time. It can take up to an hour. Sometimes it's just a couple of minutes, but we had cases also where it takes like two hours, but don't be afraid, the funds will be transferred back if you click the action button again. And also a small disclaimer, the Ethereum version, in my opinion, is also more profitable. That's why I stopped also now this bot, because I personally use the Ethereum version, because I can achieve more profits with that. That's because the entry is higher. You can start this BNB bot with 0.5 BNB. This is the minimum amount you can use it, but I would recommend you to use this with 1 BNB. And the Ethereum version, you need at least 0.3 Ethereum and the gas fees is like $130. Because of that, yeah, the competition is much, much lower, but the in income is much, 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 much higher. And I would prefer to use the Ethereum version if you're really looking into some decent passive income. Okay, this is from now on all for me. I'm working also now on a Avalanche version for Flash Loan Bonds, so stay tuned on my channel. Also, an NFT sniping bot is coming really, really soon. We're working on that. And yeah, see you guys in my next video. And hope you stay all good during the COVID pandemic. And hear you guys.